Good morning students. How are you all? I hope you all are fine and studying at your homes. Welcome to St. Joseph's Academy's online classes. Today we will learn subtracting the zero and subtraction of the same number of your maths book class 1 page number 25. We already have a little bit of idea what subtraction is as we have already done it. In this video, we will try to understand the concept of subtraction, the parts of subtraction and subtracting zero and after that how to subtract the same number from itself. So we should not delay. Let's start our class. It's a very interesting topic and you will enjoy learning it. So let's start. So first we will try to understand what is subtraction. Subtraction is removing some objects from a group. The meaning of 5 minus 2 is equal to 3 is 3 objects are taken away from a group of 5 objects and 2 objects remain. For example, as you can see in the picture, there are 5 peaches. Out of these 5 peaches, 2 peaches we have given to someone or someone has taken away from us. So we have crossed them. Now, if we subtract 2 out of 5 and we count 1, 2, 3. 3 are remaining. So, 3 is answer. So, according to this picture, out of 5 pages, we have given to 2 to someone and the remaining pages are 3 and then 3 is the answer. This is how we subtract. So, we will try to understand the subtraction with few more examples. Here, we will learn how to subtract 0. What is the method? Like before slide, we have understood what is subtraction. Now, we will learn how to subtract 0. So, as you can see in the picture, there is one flower pot on my left which is having seven flowers in it and with it there is an empty pot which does not have any flower in it. So it means we are trying to subtract zero from seven. So when we will try to subtract zero from seven the answer will remain seven because zero means nothing. And when we are subtracting nothing, it means the number will remain the same. The number of flowers will remain the same. We are having same seven flowers remaining. Now, like any other method, subtraction have its own parts and means. On every stage, it has a particular name for the stage. For example, the numbers we have in total, the objects we have in total, the figure we have in total, that is called minuet. For example, in this slide, we are having 16 numbers as minuet. Now, we have to subtract 7 out of these 16 minuets. So, the number we are going to subtract that is called subtrahend. In this slide, 7 is subtrahend. Now, after subtracting 7 out of 16, whatever the difference will get, whatever the number will get, whatever the object will remain, that is called difference. So, after 16, when we have subtracted 7, there are 9 candies remaining with us, which means 9 is the difference in this slide. 
we have subtracted 7 out of 16 and we got answer 9. So, the total number is called minuend. The number we are going to subtract that is called subtrahend and the difference we get, the answer we get that is called difference. Now, with the help of these picture examples, first we will try to understand the subtraction. Then we will learn subtracting 0 or subtracting the same number from itself. In the first row, we are having 4 butterflies and we have crossed 1. It, it means we have subtracted 1 out of 4 and the remaining if we count it will be 1, 2 and 3. So answer will be 3. In the second row there are 3 butterflies and we have crossed 2. So the sum will be 3 minus 2 and the remaining butterfly is 1. So 3 is minuend, 2 is subtract and Remaining one butterfly is the answer. In the last row, there are five butterflies. Three we have crossed. So, we will write the sum like five minus three and the answer will be two. Which means remainder will be two. Difference will be two. Answer will be two. example of the subtraction and its parts I have created here. For example, suppose a hen has laid 9 eggs. Out of these 9 eggs, I have made omelette of 6 eggs. So, how many are remaining and what these different numbers will be called? Here, the total number of eggs were 9. So, 9 is minimum. Out of this, I have made omelette of 6 eggs, which means we are going to subtract 6. So, it will be called subtrahend. We will put the minus sign on the left and we will draw a horizontal line. Now, we have to subtract these. If we count the picture, 1, 2 and 3, 3 eggs are remaining and these 3 will be called Difference. This is the answer. Here, one more example is given in your book on page number 24 How to subtract 0. In the first port, there are three fishes. In the second port, there are two fishes because one fish has been taken out. But in the third port, again, there are three fishes. So, if we minus 1 from 3, it will be 2, which is in second port. Because one fish has been taken out, so two fishes are remaining. But, when we take out 0 fish out of 3, the answer will remain 3. So, the result is, that when we subtract number 0 from any digit, the answer remains the same. The digit remains the same. It does not change. Now we have an exercise which we have to complete. Fill in. Some empty spaces are given. We have to fill those. Subtract 0 from 1, the answer will remain 1. Subtract 0 from 4, again the answer will remain 4. Subtract 0 from 6, answer will remain 6. And when we subtract 0 from 9, answer will remain 9. Because as I already told you, when we subtract 0 from any given number, the digit remains same. It does not change. Subtract 0 from 2, an answer will remain 2. Subtract 0 from 5, an answer will remain 5. Subtract 7, 0 from 7, it will remain 7. 
Subtract 0 from 10 and answer will remain 10. Subtract 0 from 3 and answer will remain 3. Subtract 0 from 0, answer will remain 0. Subtract 0 from 8 and subtract 0 from 12 and the answer will remain 8 and 12 as it is. The digit will not change. Now this is the example of how we can subtract a number from itself. First, look at the picture examples carefully. As you can see, two helicopters are parked in a ground. In the second picture, both the helicopters have taken off. So, how many have left in the ground, children? Nothing. The ground is empty because there were only two helicopters. Both have flown away. So, we are having zero helicopters left. So, we will write it as 2 minus 2 is equal to 0. Now, here we are having some examples of subtraction of same number 0. 1 minus 1. If we have 1 and we subtract 1 out of it, the answer will be 0. 2 minus 2. Again, the answer will be 0. 3 minus 3. Again, the answer will be 0. 4 minus 4, the answer will be 0. 5 minus 5, again the answer will be 0. 6 minus 6, and the answer is 0. 7 minus 7, again the answer will be 0. Why? Because we have total 7 numbers and we are subtracting 7 numbers. तो अगर हम 7 से 7 को ही कम कर देंगे तो हमारे पास क्या बचेगा कुछ नहीं बचेगा वी वोंट हैव एनीथिंग सो द आंसर विल बी 0 8 minus 8 is equal to 0 9 minus 9 is equal to 0 again 10 minus 10 is equal to 0 12 minus 12 is equal to 0 and 15 minus 15 is equal to 0 again क्योंकि हमारे पास 15 numbers थे और हमने उसमें से 15 को ही कम कर दिया, minus कर दिया, subtract कर दिया, घटा दिया तो answer will be 0 क्योंकि same number को जब हम subtract करते हैं तो हमारे पास कुछ नहीं बचता, 0 बचता है and 0 does not have any a place for itself alone. It does not stand anything alone. It doesn't have a value alone. It gets the value only when we add 0 to some numbers. Okay? One more picture example is there. In this fish pond, there were 12 fishes. But I have taken out all the 12 fishes out of this fish pond. So, if I have taken all 12 fishes out of the fish pond, how many will be remaining students? Kitni fishes bachengi pond mein? Pond mein 12 fishes thi, 12 ke 12 maine nikaal li. Tab us mein kitni bachengi? Yes, there will be 0 fishes left. Kyunki wahan par एक भी फिश नहीं बचेगी क्योंकि मैंने तो सारे निकाल ली तो जब मैं 12 से 12 को माइनस करूंगी तो आंसर विल कम 0 बिकॉज़ नथिंग इज लेफ्ट देयर आई हैव टेकन आउट ऑल द फिशेस होम असाइनमेंट दिस इज टाइम फॉर होमवर्क I hope you have understood the concept of subtracting zero and other topics we have discussed earlier. You have to practice all the work we have done in today's class and complete all the exercises in your book only. Try to learn the addition, practice it in a rough notebook, write the sums and then try to find out which sign will come there, whether addition or subtraction. So, this was the explanation of subtraction a number from itself, page 25. 
In this video, we have learned how we can subtract 0 and how we can subtract the same number from itself. For example, 12 minus 12, 9 minus 9, 6 minus 6, 3 minus 3. So, when we subtract the same number, what we get? What do we get? How do we do that? What are the parts of subtraction? Like minimand, subtrahend and difference. All these things we have learned in this video. Keep practicing students because you can learn maths only by practicing it. You cannot cram it. Practice all the sums given in your book in a rough notebook. Complete all the work in your maths book. We will meet again with the next concept. Till then, take care of yourself. Study well. Bye-bye. Have a nice day.